Hey guys, so in this review I want to go through a product called Beacon, which is kind of an all-in-one lead magnet creation tool, which also gives you some really neat ways that you can capture leads within the actual lead magnet. So if you use lead magnets in your business or you're intending to start using them, because obviously they're a really good way to capture leads and get emails off folks and build up your email list, this is going to be a really good review for you. I'll take you through the actual application itself and then I'm going to show you a place where you can get some really good discounts on this at the moment so you can save a little bit of money. So just before we start my name is Richard Darby this is the School of Nomads if you haven't been over to our channel before and you want more reviews just like this one go ahead and hit the subscribe and notification bell and I'll let you know as soon as I release new videos and if you're interested in learning how to build a business online go ahead and check out the link in the description below over to theschoolofnomads.com and I'll take you through the whole process step by step. So let's jump straight over to the actual members area and I'll kind of show you around and give you a demonstration of this. So I'm over on the main site now, the kind of layout here is very, very simple. The, on the top left hand side, you've got some training here. You can go ahead and go through those various lessons where they take you through what lead magnets are, various types of lead magnets. So it's really nice training there. And then you just come down and, and what you would see here is some existing ebooks that you've already started making. So I started creating one there, plus some templates that you can actually have once you start on the paid version, you can create templates which you can easily then modify rather than go ahead and create from new every single time. So if you come up to create new, you can either create a lead magnet or a pop-up form. So this this system allows you to create certain types of lead capture forms, most of which are actually embedded in the document itself. So I'll actually show you how that actually works. But it is, it is really neat the way that they're embedding some of these lead capture forms into the content, including locking parts of the content and people have to provide their email addresses. So that's really powerful. So I'm gonna come over to actual lead magnet and then there's various types of lead magnet you can create. A blank one, ebooks, checklists, email templates, workbook, resource guide. You've also got one once you pay for the paid version, you've also got one that is based on video, which is really nice. If I just come along and show you an ebook, the first thing it'll ask you is, do you want to import your content from a blog? And obviously that makes it easier if you've already got that content out there. So for the purpose of this demonstration, I'm just going to grab something from a blog. So if I just go and grab an article, all you need to do is, is get the article web address and post it in here. So I've actually pasted the web address in there and then it's imported the post here. And I could do that with several. So I'm just going to get one more. There you go. I've got a couple of posts there now that I can go ahead and transform into an ebook. So if I just create the publication, and then you have all of these different choices that you can go ahead and use as your main template. So the kind of look and feel of these will stay the same, but the content will be added straight into these particular books. So I'm going to go to business and have a look at those. And I'll just pick this one here, this digital marketing playbook, and I can call this anything I want. So, and then the next thing you'll see is the editor. So this is a really nice little editor function. You've got the pages on the first tab, you have cover page, you've got your table of contents, introduction about the author, you've got quotes, you've got calls to action, posts here that are actually gonna to add to the book and you can actually add a page here. The second thing is a drag and drop editor which allows you to add various things to various sections of the playbook. Then you have an overall page setting so you can come along here and actually change the look and feel of the page itself um, as well as adding images and changing margins. And then lastly you have the actual document settings itself and you can have header and footer images and you can change certain default styles in here and if you do that it'll end up changing the whole document so really really adaptable here and as i say if you go through the various pages you have your table of contents here you have an introduction here you just need to fill in the main sections here with your own information about the author change the image there and just do a little bit about yourself um, you have some quote pages here and you can add more of these so you can split this up with some quote pages Some calls to action Pages again, you can add all these and then this is my actual content that I brought in from that other website So there's an image here and then this is how it's laid out the actual content you can come along here and obviously change this but this is really nice the way that it's managed to format it kind of a usable format for me and again there's an image that got brought over straight from the blog and here's the content. So if I just go ahead and preview this, this is what it will actually look like before I send. So that has taken me a few minutes just to bring these articles over. Now, if I had this saved as a template, if I just had a 
all of my information already in here around the introduction and the, about the author, etc. This would be very, very quick to grab a piece of content and add it as a lead magnet. I want to go ahead and publish that. You can either download it as a PDF. You can have a smart PDF that people can actually see online. You can add a horizontal bar to it. You could have inline forms to it. You can add content upgrades to it, pop-up delays or link locks. So there's various things that we can add to this to actually enhance how the lead capture is actually going to be made. Now, if I hit Smart PDF, all I would need to do is provide this link to people to actually go ahead and view this PDF online. So if I publish this, then this link is all I would need to do to actually go ahead and provide them, which is really neat because it means I don't actually have to send them or download them anything. I just provide them a link. So I just show you these other options on the horizontal bar. You can actually just add a horizontal bar like here to the top of the page and people can go ahead and download additional information or additional lead magnets by providing an email. So this is really nice little tool here on the inline form. Then you can go ahead and put a form halfway through the text. So again, people can come along and add their various details to get additional information from you halfway through an ebook, which is really cool. Now the content upgrade, you can actually lock part of the content and ask them to actually give you some details to then go ahead and get that upgrade. Now on the pop-up delay, this is just like any other pop-up that once they start reading through the ebook, then once it gets to a certain stage, you could then time it so that the pop-up will appear and they can get additional information from you. And then the last one, the link lock is you just provide a link to your particular lead magnet and people then just have to provide an email address to get through to your lead magnet. And I think these are some really some nice ideas rather than just always send people off to a landing page to provide information to get a lead magnet. There's other ways here that they've come up with to actually capture people's email addresses just by giving that lead magnet out for free. I think some of these ideas are really nice. So I'll just jump back over to the actual main page. Again, if you go to pop up form, you would add your pop up form name and then you could actually design the different types of pop up form that you'd like to see actually being used alongside the document. So if I just unlock this one, you can again, there's lots and lots of things you can do here as far as the editing of a pop up form, all sorts of different ways that you can get quickly edit these and you have a confirmation here as well. So once people have actually opted in, there's a confirmation email that you can get sent out and then you have the integration. So th there is a few providers here, MailChimp, Drip, Converge Kit, Active Campaign, MailerLite. And I know that they are adding more and more of these all the time. So, and then you would just go ahead and publish and that would be then your pop-up form that you could use to capture leads who come along and want to actually use your lead magnets. So I think this is really nice. This is a really nice interface, very, very simple to use. Lots and lots of choice around how you create those lead magnets and how you edit those lead magnets. So yeah, this is a really nice interface and I think I'm definitely going to purchase this because this is something that I also use in my business. So if I come up to upgrade, you'll see the various prices, price plans here from on the particular site. So you've got a free version here, which is the one I'm using now before I go ahead and purchase. Very, very restrictive. But then when you go to $49 a month, it unlocks all of the various features apart from the integration with HubSpot and being able to use custom domain names, which is obviously going to be important if you want to use this in your own business. And then if you pay $99, it unlocks all of the various features. But I have found a place that you can get a big discount on this at the moment. So let's jump over to AppSumo and I'm going to show you the pricing over in AppSumo. So here's the pricing over in AppSumo. As I said, it was $49 up to $99 a month for the version they've got over on their website. At the moment, AppSumo, you've got a really good deal of $69 for one user. And it's got all of those various features that I said were in the top plan. So all of the, everything's captured there. And then you can get a double code, which is $138. And that's if you want five users actually using this. So you might have a team of people that produce these types of things. And that would be a really good deal for you. So excellent deal over an AppSumo at the moment. And you know, if you do produce lead magnets for your particular company, this would be a really nice tool for you to utilize because there's so many different options for editing. So thanks for watching that review. 
I just wanted to go over this tool called Beacon because it's something that I think I'm going to purchase. I do use lead magnets in my business and this is going to be a really easy way for me to create them quickly so that I can capture more and more email leads. So if you're interested, um, check out the link in the description below. There's going to be a link there over to AppSumo. You can come and check this out. So again, thanks for your time. This has been Richard Darby. This is the School of Nomads. If you're interested in hearing more reviews just like this one, go ahead and hit the subscribe and notification bell and I'll let you know as soon as I produce new videos. And if you are interested to know how to build a business online, go ahead and check out the link in the description below to the School of Nomads and I'll take you through the whole process step by step. Until next time, take care.